Hey everyone, thanks so much for tuning in. Today I'm going to show you how I made my Halloween inspired doormat using Dollar Tree materials. So I started off with this Dollar Tree doormat and it has one side with ridges and one side without, but they both slide around. So you're going to want to create some traction with hot glue. Now you can do whatever design you want, but I did swirlies because it used up the least amount of glue. So I did this to the entire back side, and once you flip it over, it shouldn't slide around as much and you won't fall on your butt. So now with this Halloween decor from Dollar Tree, I used some double-sided tape on the back side, and you don't need to add it to the whole thing, but you do need to add enough to where it doesn't move around on your mat while you're spray painting. So you're just going to place this directly onto your mat and you can add as many as you want or other designs. For the wording, I use these adhesive letters from Dollar Tree and this is where the ridges come in handy because it makes sure that your letters are straight on wherever you'd like them. So this brings enough letters to write trick or treat, enter if you dare, welcome. It definitely does bring a nice variety of letters, but I chose enter if you dare. I added the third kitty off to the side and then I took it outside and gave it a coat of magenta. Now you don't want to spray paint like this, you want to spray paint above and do the area with details first. You don't want to swipe side to side so it doesn't get under, but then once you get the details in, you can go ham. So you want to make sure that it dries up really well and once it's dry you can remove all of your stencils. So now that everything is removed you can leave it as is but I used this acrylic paint pen and I outlined everything to make it a little neater. And that's it guys! I hope that you enjoyed this video and found it helpful. If you did, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe for more DIYs. Thank you so much for watching.